and welcome, welcome. I'm Christy from Christy Stampin' Spot. I am an independent Stampin' Up! demonstrator here in the United States. Welcome, welcome. I am going to do a quick um, show and tell of my unboxing of my new um, September to December mini catalog uh, goodies. I'm really excited to, sh to share them with you. Um, um, I didn't get a ton, but I did get some great stuff to start with. It's a fabulous catalog. You guys are going to love it. Um, so today is August 14th. Oh my gosh, it's already the 14th. Um, let me check to make sure um, oh, I'm where I'm supposed to be. and Everything looks good. Let's see, look, it says I'm live. Sure, I can hear myself. Ooh, I hear it. So we have. Um, it's awesome. <laughs> um, so it looks like everything's great. So let me go ahead and set turn you guys down. So I know we've just. I mean, in May we got our new um, annual catalog, and next month, um, starting I think it's September fourth, you um, you guys will be able to see this catalog and. Um, order from it as well as download the copy. Um, my customers should have been getting their, um, you guys should all be getting your, your mini catalogs soon in the mail, so hopefully you'll get those before September so you guys can look at those. Um, there's lots of awesome stuff. I can't show you the inside until um, the 4th, but um, there it's chock full of fabulous stuff. And if you don't have a demonstrator here in the United States and you'd like to get your hands on a physical copy of um, our new catalog. I will have the, um, you can request a catalog, I'll have that in the description of this video. And of course you can do that on my website as well. But oh, it's, 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 there's so much awesomeness in it. So I was really excited when I got my catalog um, to go through. De demonstrators could see it last month, and but it's only on the digital and I love, It's there's nothing like getting it, uh, a copy of these, uh, the, catalog in your hands. There's so many great ideas. Okay. Oh my gosh. There's so much, so much to see. So let's see. Where should I, where should I start? I'm going to start with our embellishments because they're on the top and I almost always forget to do them because um, in the excitement of showing all, all the sets and stuff, I somehow sometimes forget. And I actually went on and made sure that I could see. Um, so these ones are a little bit, they have a little, these are small but they have a little bit of, de um, they're a little thick. Um, they're really pretty. And these are called the Regal Foil, um, Regal Foil Dots. And let me pull them out so you can see them better. They're pretty, they have green. And so the colors are Shaded Spruce, um, Night of Navy, Blackberry Bliss, and Berry Burst. So you can see those and it has like little pieces of gold foil in it so pretty so pretty and then i was super excited about these these are our red and white adhesive back peppermints and these are really thin i think these will be perfect for cards for our christmas cards they are so totes adorbs and there's three different sizes i love it when they have the different sizes um and there's quite a few in here what is 150 yeah it's fat I love these. These are awesome. I think these are going to be a favorite. Love, love, love. We also have some fa, uh, fa, faux glass dots. And the, the colors are Cajun Craze. There's Cajun Craze. Oh, you know what? You can't even see the other one because it's underneath. Let's see if I can open this over here. Do, do, do. These are the faux glass dots there we go there are cajun craze that looks like that one is copper clay mossy mellow mossy mellow mossy meadow and um wild wheat and again these are also have a little bit um they're like little round dots right so they're not they have a little bit of bump right they're not um they're not really flush like those peppermints are those peppermints are super flush which is super awesome but these are pretty too I kind of like these. So they're kind of like frosted, um, faux gas. They kind of look like, you know, when you get that glass that washes up on the shore um, at the beach, right, where it's not like the color's a little dull. 
That's what it looks like. It's pretty cool, actually. And then, ooh, I already used some of these. These are the gold texture, the gold textured adhesive um, back dots. So these ones are, um, I don't know, they kind of look like wild wheat, a little bit like wild wheat to me. Um, but they do have a little bit of texture to them. They're pretty. And again, they're the dots, so they have a little bit. They're not flat. Um, so that, they're kind of cool. And they're in three different sizes, too, um, which is nice for those holiday projects coming up. Now, this is fun. This is something new. This is called the Dursley Adhesive Backed Embellishments. And I had to look up what that means. That And it looks like um, kind of, they look kind of like, um, and they feel, so they've got, they're definitely thick, but they also have a texture on the top. So it's like open crystal, like, or an open geode. I bet you these would look really pretty if you, um, I'm thinking coloring on purple, like, it would look like amethyst. So this is like champagne and white or silver. You can see those. They have a really pretty shine. And these are called the Dursley. So it's not smooth on the top. These are, they have like a texture on the top. Um, it's not super sharp, but um, definitely um, has a texture on the top. Like, you can totally feel it. And these are the Dursley. And that's what Dursley means, I guess, is like an opened um, crystal. That's kind of what that means. So I think of it like a geode. Right? It's pretty. It's really pretty, though. These are really pretty. Okay. And then I think I've shown you guys these ones before. This is the ones that came with that winter, um, the winter... Oh, the one with the birds that we had not too long ago. And these colors, the, these are the earth tone shimmer ones. Um, shimmer, are they dots? Gems. And they're copper clay, very vanilla, crumb cake, and garden green. These are really pretty, I think. And these ones are definitely, they have a lower, they're not as, but not as thick as the dots. It has a, um, so these are really good for cards. And they have a nice shimmer to them. So I really like these. These are really pretty. These are the Earth Tone, and I, I've used these a bunch because we we were able to get to pre-order those for Creativity Now. I think these are going to be my favorite for the season. The peppermints, are so pretty, and these ones are gorgeous too. The um the regal foil dots, because those are just beautiful colors with that gold in it. So pretty, so pretty. Okay, all right. So that is our embellishments. I'll show you now. We have some ribbons too. And I, it's funny as I spent like an hour looking. For one of the ribbons that I thought I ordered, I hadn't, and eventually go back to my order to check because I could have sworn I had it, but I didn't. So, like those um, shiny earth, the shiny earth tone, no, earth tone shimmer gems, the um, natural tones linen thread is also part of that, that winter um, birds. I forget what the name of that is called, but I've shown that to you guys before, but that's one of the things. And the other, so there's two ribbons I did not get that's in this new catalog. There's one that's a shaded spruce that is really gorgeous, as well as a red and white uh, twine that's also very pretty um, that's in there. But then there's this fun one. Oh, my gosh. I like this one. This is called the um, Pool Party. Um... No, is it pom pom ribbon? Okay, so it's a pool party pom pom ribbon. So it's got this nice um, pool party ribbon center. It's like sheer satin, and then it has these little pom poms. They're so cute. Um, and it's so. I mean, I don't think you can. It's not really great for like making. Um, well, I guess you could make bows with it, but um, I think this is going to be a great for layering it across your across your um, cards or for your um, scrapbook stuff um, I there's pictures of it they're using it to, like actually putting it on a stocking um, it's really pretty and I love the sweet that this goes with so this is the pool party pom-pom and we have this pretty one which is blackberry bliss and gold textured ribbon and this is a really nice Wait, this is really pretty. It's got the gold in it. So it's very classy. I like the Blackberry Bliss. It's kind of nice texture for Christmas. It makes beautiful bows. Look at that. It's very pretty. Really liking that. And that, like, so that's the Blackberry Bliss and gold textured 
then we have this um, perfect for like our fall projects. And this is a um, wild wheat. So this is the wild wheat rustic striped ribbon. How gorgeous is that? Like it's kind of got like it's like a neutral on the inside. Isn't that pretty? So pretty. Love, love, love. This has got a nice feel to it. I think this will be pretty. I can't wait to get some of this on, use some of this on a project. Because, you know, I'm, I'm not sure if I love wild wheat, but it kind of, like, if you're going to use it for um, almost like gold, like a dull gold color, it's pretty. I like it. So that one is the um, wild wheat rustic striped ribbon. Okay, and then the last one I have is the satin ribbon. It is cherry cobbler and gold satin ribbon. And it says it's gold, but it looks almost copper to me on this. Look at it, it's unraveling. I need to get my thing out. You see that? Isn't that pretty? And this is definitely a thinner ribbon, right? And because it's width is smaller, it'll make a really great bows. Um, yeah, this would also make good. Use This would make be lovely for hanging ornaments. If you're going to make handmade ornaments. Um, and cherry cobbler is just a fabulous color. Hopefully our cherry cobbler paper will be in. We've been out of cherry cobbler paper for a little, the eight and a half by 11 um, has been out for a little bit. So hopefully we'll get some more cardstock in soon. I don't remember seeing when it's supposed to be in, but that pretty, oh, love, love, love. It is very, very nice. It's a beautiful ribbon. Okay, so those are the ribbons. And I always forget to show them because I get so excited about the paper and um, the other stuff. Okay, so, oh my gosh, guys. This is probably my favorite pack of paper in the new catalog. It is called the um, Splendid Autumn 6x6 six six paper. It has um, a bunch of colors. A um, Azure Afternoon, Balmy Blue, Cajun Craze, Cherry Cobbler, Crushed Curry, Fresh Frasia, Garden Green, Ma Moody Mauve, Mossy Meadow, all Old Olive, Pumpkin Pie, and Wild Wheat, right? So it's a great pack of paper. Here, and I pulled six out so I can show you guys them. So I don't have to go through the things. And they have beautiful B-sides, too. They're just gorgeous. So look at that. Isn't that just beautiful? And then we have that. Looks like Cajun Craze on that side. Look how gorgeous that those daisies are. Isn't that beautiful? It's a fresh Frasia. And this definitely has that autumn feel. It's very pretty. Look at that one. That is gorgeous. And I think this this paper is going to be beautiful for, you know, any kind of cards you want to make this fall. I think this is, like, one of my favorite sheets. Isn't that beautiful? Love, love, love. So, I don't know if that's daisies or is that black-eyed Susans. I don't know because it's not sunflowers. But they're gorgeous, 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 gorgeous. There's that wild wheat. There's some wheat, actual wheat. That beautiful. What color is that? It looks like one of the blues. It's balmy blue, I think. That's what that one is. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Just gorgeous, gorgeous. So, um, I know the autumn leaves. Look at those autumn leaves changing color. There's some wild wheat. Pretty, so pretty, so pretty. Nice white, green, more of those. The path, I like the path ones. And then here's one that's got blooms, the last one. Isn't that pretty? Okay, so this is the Splendid Autumn paper. So it's similar to like the, me the meadow paper we've had. We've had some papers that are like this. Mirandering Meadow, I think, is one that's in. Um, that's in the uh, online exclusives that's like this. And then um, Thoughtful Journey is in the annual catalog. I think there's another one too. But I love, love, love. It's so beautiful. I mean, isn't that gorgeous? <gasps> so gorgeous. I love this paper. Okay. So that is, again, going to be in the new mini, which I'm very excited. Okay. So we also have some. This is called the Regal Winter. It has a beautiful floral suite that goes with it. I did not get this floral suite yet. It's on my maybe list, but this paper is so gorgeous. Um, 12 by 12. Look at that. Oh, look at that deep color. So this is a winter. So this isn't necessarily Christmas. It's just a winter kind of um, paper. 
Uh, it's really rich, I would think. It's really sumptuous kind of a paper. Um, the colors are Berry Burst, Blackberry Bliss, Cherry Cobbler, Night of Navy, Pretty Peacock, Shaded Spru Spruce, and Wild Wheat. And I think it's the, the Pretty Peacock that I just absolutely love, love, love. So um, the Regal Winter. So this is really pretty. I don't know. This reminds me of Hawaii. I don't know why, but I love that color. And then that red is just so lovely and deep. That one, so pretty. It's just gorgeous, 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 gorgeous. There's that pretty peacock. I just love the pretty peacock. I don't know what it is, but pretty peacock. I just love. Here is another sheet, so you can see that's different. Oh, wait, no, that one's the same. Do I get a bunch of, is it four sheets? Oh, no, it's different. It looks very similar, but it's totally not. This, is it the same? No, it is. It's the same. Maybe it's... Oh, but look at the back. It's different. So... See, look at the back on that one. Isn't that pretty? Right? So we know... Oh, I guess it's got black. Oh, I see. Okay. So if you look at it, these are really close. These are really close. So you can see that this has, like, um the red in the background, and this one has kind of the black in the background so you can really tell that's I mean you really have to look because this really looks the same I think if I hadn't done it this way I probably would have been like are they not the same color but you can tell from the back side that they are because that blue that blue is gorgeous all right so we've got red and we've got that gorgeous blue again okay, oh and I love this this paper is just absolutely beautiful uh, beautiful 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 and then there's that lovely, this, this is just gorgeous. I just love that pop of purple in there. So pretty. So I guess that's probably Blackberry Bliss. It's gorgeous. And there's that on that color. So the B-sides are pretty too on this. Look at that. I just love the variations of color. So pretty. So pretty. And there's more of that pretty peacock. Love. Kind of that black in the background. It's gorgeous. You know, red's not my favorite, but this paper just really really speaks to me. I just love how it has that dark, a little bit of darkness in there. It's so pretty. And then there's the, the wild bee. So pretty. Okay. So this is the Regal. Like I said, it comes with a floral. And this one might actually have, this might be the, the one that goes with this, this ribbon, the Blackberry Bliss ribbon. It's really pretty. It's really, really pretty. That's the Regal winter like i said the the it's got a floral um bundle that goes with it and then um let's see i can set this aside so it's out of the way a little bit and then this goal oh my gosh this goes with the with the forest suite and i'm always like oh i don't need another set of trees but, oh my gosh i know i'm gonna totally get these trees because they're gorgeous okay this is called season of elegance 12 by 12 um, and the colors on this are basic beige, cr a cherry cobbler, crumb cake, gray granite, lost lagoon, mossy meadow, old olive, pretty peacock, and real red and gold. So you can see it's got this gold. This is absolutely beautiful. And it's in a, a, a giant suite. The suite is a double suite. Um, it's just beautiful. There's that beige. Not pretty. Oh, so pretty. And the trees. The trees are gorgeous. I did get the embossing folder that goes with this suite. Not pretty. Oh, the old olive. So pretty. Yeah, so on this. I think this this paper is just absolutely gorgeous. Specialty paper. Gold. Wheat. Here is red. Look at that red. Isn't that beautiful? Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And then here is the green. This looks like um, more old olive. And it looks like it's got like a paint texture um, underneath the gold too. Isn't that pretty? And it looks like under here it's got canvas. So there's a lot going on. So it's really good. Really pretty. It's got like great texture. Um, it's gorgeous. And then of course I think my favorite is the pretty peacock. I just love pretty peacock. Isn't that beautiful? Oh, so beautiful. And then look at that. It's like it paint drips, but it's like on canvas. So pretty. So pretty. Okay. So this pack of paper is 12 by 12 specialty season of elegance. 
which is gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Okay, and then the last pack I'm going to show you guys is this. Oh, wait, no, I guess there's one more. Okay, so there is another set of Glimmer, the Festive Glimmer, and it's Cherry Cobbler, Garden Green, and Granny Apple Green. Sure. So it's Garden Green, um, Cherry Cobbler. It's really bright. Look at that. Look at that beautiful um, glitter and then the light green. Isn't that beautiful? Perfect for Christmas. Well, these two are like great for summer too. Look at that red. Isn't that beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And that also is going to be in the new catalog. Um, the mini that you can get starting September 4th. I love the glimmer. And you know, again, it's that glimmer that doesn't shed. So it's going to be super nice. I love it. It's so pretty. Okay. And then this, this is it, right? I love this paper. Okay, this is the Snowy Scenes. What's exciting about this paper is when, um, um, in September, you'll be able to get, there'll be a pack where you can get uh, with scrapbooking stuff. We're going to have a scrapbooking for sure. It's also going to go live in September that will have a pack of this paper that ha that includes sticker sheets. So keep in mind when you're looking at that, that might be something you want. The colors in this snowy scenes is Daffodil Delight, Early Espresso, Early Espresso, Garden Green, Petal Pink, Pool Party, Poppy Parade, and Pumpkin Pie. And this is the one that, that this super cute pool party with the little um, pom-poms. That goes with this. And then let me go ahead before I get too farther ahead. It actually matches this stamp set the snowy wonder um bundle and it um has some pieces that the dies actually um die cut out of our paper so um, i'm pretty sure the tr the tree the two trees the snowman the penguin and the snowflake um um do a die cut out of this paper so we've got some mini snow globes here on this side and then some beautiful, um, these are gorgeous. I love uh, snowflakes. I love snowflakes. And then here's some big, um, these are the bigger uh, snow globes. And I'm pretty sure that the snow globes, these ones can be die cut out with the dies. I'm pretty sure. So you can die cut the whole piece out, right? Here, you can do, I cut the whole piece out, or I think, no, see this, so this snowman, you can do the snowman, but you, it would cut off his, his earmuffs, so you probably wouldn't want to use that on this, on these ones, but you can totally use the, um, the dies to cut the snow globe out of this paper, which is kind of cool, um, if you wanted to do that, you can totally do that, which is pretty, and I'm, I'm pretty sure these snowflakes will also, but you don't want to ruin those beautiful snow globes, right? And I love that it's on petal pink. And then I love this paper. I think this, I mean, I love this. But I love the, the petal pink and it's got these really big snowflakes, right? The different sizes and it's got the different variation of color too. I just love when they do that. It's such a pretty piece of paper. Love, love, love. Okay. And we have the snow, the snowman. And now the snowman here, this one again, die cuts out. But um, see how he doesn't have a hat? But these ones will, um, it will cut off his hat, right? Or cut off the earmuffs. So the ones that are the plain snowman, your die will cut out. But I believe it also cuts out the tree right here. See that tree it cuts out. And I believe this other tree it cuts out too right here. And then I think it does the snowflake. Let's see. Let's see. Doo, doo, doo. Yeah, see, it will cut out the snowflake. Although these snowflakes are mostly on this page, they're almost attached to something else. But that snowflake will will die cut out, and I think the little one will also. Yeah, I think the little one will also. Oh, I don't know if it'll do on this one. Die cut too, which is pretty awesome. That's super cute. I really like the background color. It's a really nice, pretty piece of paper. And then, ooh, look at that. That's kind of a fun, um, different kind of plaid. I like that. This looks very much like the plaid that the new embossing folder, I'm going to show you a little later, um, 
snakes, which is pretty. Here's the penguins. And then just like the snowmen, the plain penguins, it die cuts out. But the ones with, you know, if you cut out the one with the hat, it's little hat. The little ball in his hat will not come out. Right? I think the scarf one is okay. The plain one, but the one with the earmuffs, it'll cut off his earmuffs. And the, the ball on the other, on the ones with the hat. Isn't that cute? These penguins are totes adorbs. And then there's some trees. Isn't that pretty? There's little, the trees are nice. Um, very nice. Um, yeah, okay. Cool. And then we've got some holly. This is some nice big bold holly. Um, and then some beautiful stripes with candy cane stripes, but the, the stripes aren't, aren't um, all even, which I kind of like when it's a little bit um, not even. And then we have some cute little houses. Those are so cute. And then um, they're candy canes on the back. So, isn't that awesome? I like the little candy canes. These little houses are cute. I think they would make good to put them inside. We're going to put them inside here. Um, we're going to make a uh, snow globe with them. Fussy cut them out. So pretty. Love, love, love. So, this is, like I said, this is the Snowy Scenes 12 by 12. And this suite um, it is in the suite with the Snowy Wonder stamp set and dies. It's got this beautiful um, pom-pom, petal pink, and I don't know um, if it's the, I'm trying to think if, I don't remember and I can't look because I'll show you guys and I don't want to get into trouble for looking inside the catalog. Um, it goes, I think we have a couple of embossing folders, so let me get out the embossing folder. Let me see if I can get this paper back in it in the sleeve. I like these sleeves, these pocket sleeves. These are stamp and storage. They're nice. They keep them nice. 12 by 12. Um, let's see. We have two embossing folders in this new um, mini catalog. And they are um, and, um, the Painted Trees 3D. Like So we have a another paint, uh, leaf, our leaf, a, a tree. There's actually a couple trees. But this is like one that you can use for every day. Any, any occasion trees, they're not really Christmas trees. You can use them as Christmas trees, but they're not. But this is the Painted Trees 3D Embossing Folder. It's gorgeous. As you can see all that detail. It's very beautiful. Um, so that's one of the embossing folders that's in the new catalog, as well as this fun Forever Plaid 3D. And it is not like, um, there's some of the way, the lines are wavy they're not it's not 100 percent perfect so that's really pretty there i did the boss of that is that pretty so it's nice it's, and it's not like a lot off but it is a little bit so um it's not 100 percent perfect but um which i kind of like i kind of like when it's a little off um it's pretty it's kind of makes it a little bit more whimsical very pretty and that is the forever plaid and if you can see this is the six by six right so this is the six by six, and then this is one of those really big ones, right? So it's eight and a half by six, so it's really big. One of those really big six by eight and a half. Huge. I think it's eight and a half. Um, let me check. It is big. I think they're. I think the big ones are. Yeah, eight and a half. So we've got a few now, so we've got another one. The other one that was in this, it's in the mini catalog that you'll be able to get is a part of that, that suite that we talked, that I showed you before, the wood one. Um, this one right here, the birch, the birch one. So the birch one will be available too starting September 4th. And I believe this one might be on back order, the, the circles 3D. I really like this one. This one's pretty, this world's one. So we now we're going to have four of the new... Um, of these large ones, right? They're pretty huge. They're pretty huge. Okay, they're nice. I think that plaid. So that plaid looks very similar to the plaid that's on in the designer shirts paper. The the snowy um, scenes. That orange. What color? I think it's pumpkin pie, which is an interesting color. I mean, it looks pretty, um, but pumpkin pie is an interesting color to go with. 
that. So you see that plaid? That's very similar to the plaid that's here. I mean, I just think pumpkin pie is an interesting color for Christmas paper. But it's pretty. It looks nice. Although that, that piece you could probably use for your um, Thanksgiving cards, right? Or maybe I might be able to even use that for Halloween, that pumpkin pie plaid. It's pretty. Oh, they're going to make their own with the plaid. 3D embossing folder, which is gorgeous. Okay, so those are those. Okay, so now let's look at, um, I've showed you the suite that has, that makes um, the snow globes. And what's cool about this is you don't have like the, the other piece that you need to get, the um, uh, like the little shells to do the, sh to do the, sh the um, shaker cards, right? These are, you can make them flat or you can add, you know, use the foam and make them shaker cards um so they're not you know but you don't have to buy the extra pieces right it's just that you can use the just the dies um to make it work which is pretty awesome um i really i really like this and like i mentioned too i, th I think demonstrators are going to be able to see it later on this month but starting september 4th there's going to be some new scrapbooking stuff which is very exciting and one of the things that's coming out is a another pack of that snowy um scenes designer service paper that includes the sticker sheet so i believe the sticker sheets won't be sold separately they'll be sold with that that pack of that paper that goes with the pumpkin the penguins it's so cute i love those penguins they're so totes adorbs okay what did i do with that thing okay so there'll be lots you guys will see lots of this coming soon and then um, I got, there was a couple of stuff that I, I usually like to do like all the Halloween stuff. We didn't have very much Halloween stuff in this new annual, um, in the new mini. There's a few, there's a, a few fun, mul uh, different, multiple seasons. We have this More Than Autumn, which is super totes adorbs. It has um, kind of the pumpkin spice, right? Pumpkin pie. It's got the little gingerbread. He's so cute. And then it's got a lot of really awesome words, right? So it's got the pumpkin season, fall, apple, donuts, autumn, eggnog, hot cocoa, peppermint, cider, pie, spice. You are the blank. You know, it says you are. And so it's one of those builds. Build your own. Nothing's better than. Grateful. It's finally. Love you more than you had me at. Except maybe you. This calls for. Is the best. To my and hello. So, I mean... That is pretty awesome. What makes this really great are the dies. So the dies also cut out words. Cocoa and like, I think, see, I did. Um, here is season. So it's a lovely cursive. So you can add them to the, to your, um, the words. There's pumpkin, um, season. Um, it's pretty, they're just really gorgeous. And then, so it has the, the, the pieces that cut out all of your um, cut out all of your images, and then you have some words that you can cut out, which is you know nothing better than. So that's really awesome. I I really love it when they do that. It's fun, and you can see I cut out. I did I did use that on a, on a card, but I, I haven't used played with this one yet. I love this. I think this will look great for Christmas with peppermint, or you can make it easily be like pumpkin spice. Like I think. Um, this is going to be a really great one. And it is also a million dollar earner stamp set. This looks like Joe Golden's um, stamp set. It's gorgeous with these sets of, of dies. So this will be available starting September 4th. Um, and I think, okay, here we go. Here, this is a standalone stamp set that is super cute. It's called Warms My Heart. And it has a deck the halls with wreaths of holly. I would pick you over and over again. Memories of you warm my heart and hey pumpkin. And it has like a lady with a pumpkin. Um, this looks like a, looking at a snow globe, picking apples and with the wreath. See, I colored the lady with the um, apples. Um, I haven't made that. I was going to put that on a card and I ended up not having enough time to do that. But I did make this card. And I used, on this card, I used a piece of, that um, Splendid Autumn Designer Series paper that I colored. Um, and I did fussy cut because there's no dyes that came out. So I made color that, um, put her in there. And then this is some of the, the Glimmer paper that is 
Oh, what is the name of that glimmer paper? Cut it out. Do do do. I should look at and see what what the name of that glimmer paper is. It is the oh yeah, that's twenty four twenty twenty four twenty 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 six in color glimmer paper. So this is that peach um, peach pie glimmer that I used on this card that is available in the annual catalog. And then there's that piece of this, this Blackberry Bliss ribbon. So I just added that. And then the pumpkin spice, this pumpkin season is from the More Than Autumn. So um, I added a bunch of stuff. I thought it turned out, it turned out super cute. And there is a Happy Thanksgiving. The Happy Thanksgiving is not in the annual catalog. It's actually in the, um, uh, or is not in the mini catalog. It's in the annual catalog. It is the Choose Happy stamp set. It's got a little pumpkin. This is with that choose from the Choose Happy stamp set, as well as there's like a little penguin. So it's like an an all occasion type um, stamp set. That that's where you can find that Happy Thanksgiving um, that I use there. But isn't that pretty pumpkin season? Love that with the peach. So it's on a um, it's on a piece of pumpkin pie, but with that peach pie um, glimmer. It's so pretty. And then I actually when I made when I cut this. I actually cut the inside out, so this is a frame so that I could use some of that. So I didn't lose as much of the glimmer paper behind there that you can't see. But isn't that pretty? And I, I made these with the little, these are our with, oh, it's called celebration dies. I cut them in half and just gave the little tails on there. Um, what are they? They're like little, um, they're in the annual cap. No, they're an online exclusive. They're an online exclusive. You can get them in a bundle. Here we go. The Happy Little Things dies. And it has these two little dies. And it's this one right here. The little vanilla die that I used. And then I just I cut it out and then I um, just snipped it and, and used a little bit of stamp and seal and hooked it on the back of that. And then just put a little piece of that ribbon. I think it turned out pretty level stuff. Okay, so that's that that's this this uh, warms my heart. Um, it's so pretty. I think if you like to use the blends, I use the blends, or if you want to use um, the water, uh, your um, watercoloring, or um, even the watercolor pencils look pretty. Okay. And then there's another um, standalone that I just ha ha couldn't wait to get put, uh, on paper. This is called Dear Santa, which is so adorable. Um, it has a bunch of little kids. Look at how cute these are. She's got her little tongue out. She's like so concentrating so hard on making her little Santa list. So it's hope your holidays are sweet. There's Dear Santa. Always love hanging with you. Have an ice Christmas. There's the little tree. Oh. So I made one using um, some of the one, uh, the little Oh, where are the, these dies are from the, um, they are from one of the other sets. Oh, the, from, from the Snowy Wonder. I used the Snowflake from the Snowy Wonder set for this. And then I've got, this is the, the painted texture, which is still an online store available, that embossing folder. These are that wildflower, wildflower designs. I love the wildflower design dies. And then there's the have a nice Christmas. And look how cute. He's like, oh, no, I'm going to fall. Try not to fall on his skates. I added a little bit of that, um, the new ribbon that's the pool party pom-pom um, satin ribbon, which is very pretty on the edges there. Isn't he super cute? And so we were like, he looks terrified and freaked out, but he is totally trying not to fall. I think it's adorable. So adorable. Like I said, I just added a, um, some of that cute um, I love the snowflakes. So these are the snowflakes from the, the penguins, the, what is this, Snowy Wonder. And if you don't, there's also a complete, another, um, it's a smaller bundle, but it is a dye bundle. It's called One of the Kind. There's actually not, there's actually two really nice snowflakes. So I'll be showing the other one um, later because it didn't go in my very first order. But this is called One of a Kind, and it does have two, it has these two dyes that match. Um, the one that cuts out the image 
Um, and then this one makes its own, which is very pretty. And it's got a to and from. And it says, thank you for your kindness. A little something just for you. Sending a flurry of happy wishes. I love that. I can see them flurries. It's so pretty. And I, I think maybe because I'm in Arizona, I love snowflakes. We don't get snow very often. That's probably what it is. <laughs> I love it. It's got like a little wind swirl. You are one of a kind, wonderful friend. Hope you have the merriest season ever. Oh, excuse me. I really like this. This is super cute. Like, so there's one other um, set in there that's that's got icicles. It's pretty. And I didn't even get the reindeer. We have two different reindeer sets with reindeer paper. Super cute. So keep an eye out for that stuff, which I haven't done yet. Okay, so the other, the, the last... Um, stamp set bundle I have for you guys is also totes adorbs and I again did not have um, time to do I want to lose this let me put this away I lost my my little tree I want to make sure I don't lose it lose it let me throw it in there do 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 oh and I didn't even show you that I saw another thing of embellishments I totally forgot about okay this is called the Christmas friends I didn't get a chance to cut the cut die cut these out Look at the little owl, isn't he cute? And there's like a uh, ice skating moose and a little and a little um, reading mouse with a bell on his tail. Super totes adorbs. And then the other one I hadn't colored is the polar bear. Isn't he cute? And it says, Happy Holidays. I'll be thinking of you this season. Have a merry, berry Christmas. Have a berry, merry Christmas. It's got like a little tree um, flaunt in there, but isn't that cute? I love the cute animals. And then the, here's the dies that go with it. So the Christmas Friends dies. So it cuts out all of the images. So I'm going to be able to, to cut these out. But it also has like bows. So it's got stars. It's got musical notes. Um, it's got a bow. And see the little crosses? This is also for the ribbon to go on these packages. So you can like die cut out some little square packages from um, your designer shirt paper. Um, they've got a couple of wreaths, and then it's got like a little bow that you can put on there as well. Here's one that's got the strings, and then there's one that's like a bow tie bow. There's also a little um, uh, thought bubble, which is kind of fun. And then there's the, a different kind of bow here. So there's lots of all bows. So the way I saw them use this um, die, too, is to make like the den. That's a big, nice circle die, um, but they use it with the polar bear. That's how they showed it in the catalog. But, um, and then there's the tree that cuts out the tree die there. So this is a really fun, if you like the cute Christmas, I really do love the cute Christmas. Isn't that pretty? This cute. And it was funny, is the first time I saw this, I was thinking it was a penguin, a fat penguin, because I needed my glasses. <laughs> He's definitely an owl. And it's got the totally cute pun, I'll be thinking of you this season, which is super totes adorbs. But... I love that. Okay, so that is the last of my new um, bundles that I want to show you guys. But I forgot. I always forget one of the embellishments. Here is for shaker cards. If you want to make shaker cards, it is a part of the um, the snowy scenes. I think it's called snowy scenes, which is the one with the penguins, right? Um, the this set here. Or did I do with the snowy penguin? There we go. Snowy Wonder is the stamp set. But they have these really pretty white loose snowflakes. So they're like hard plastic. Well, like it's not hard plastic because they kind of have a little bit get of give. As you can see, they have a little bit. They're different kind, different sizes. Um, there's a ton of them in here, which are perfect for shaker cards. But they're also big enough you can put... Um, a glue dot maybe a tiny bit of glue and then put them on your front of your card front too so um these are called loose white snowflakes and um let's see does it say how many are in here i'm sure they did it by weight is it approximately 956 pieces in a thing is what it says which is insane right that's a lot but it's lovely this is perfect for shaker cards um very awesome. I love the snowflakes. I love snowflakes. Okay, and the other fun thing that we have that I got that I have that is a box. So they have these boxes 
that are called book treat boxes. You get a pack of 10. They've already got the adhesive in them. They're already die cut, right, with all of the um, score lines, right? So what you do is you'll put this, you'll put it together, um, glue these two pieces down like this. So you've got it um, to make the little pull-out box. And then you're actually going to put it right here on um, the this adhesive strips because it's already got its stuff. Right, and it just goes in here like that. So you don't need to put more here, right? You just need it on that one little edge. And then it closes like that. Now you can always um, close that off or you can put like a little piece of Velcro when you're done decorating on, on there. So you have the, the two different ends of Velcro. And you can always take off the sticky. Now if you can't get the sticky off, you can always use your embossing buddy to de-sticky it um, before you put on your um, Velcro so that you don't have to worry about that, whatever. Because once you put that on there and stick it, it's hard. It, it won't, you won't get to use it again, right? It, it'll tear probably pulling it apart. But you can put all kinds of snacks. A gift card would fit in here, too. Um, it's just super cute. It reminds me of those lifesaver boxes that we had back in the day. I don't know if they still do those lightsaber life saver boxes, but it's super cute. I mean, I love the book. I think I'm gonna try to do something with the um, the spells, make this like a book of spells, right? That would be super cute. Um, so uh, for Christmas and for Halloween, just so oh, this is kind of an adorable. You can even do it for birthday, especially if you like books. These are super cute. So like I said, these are called the Book Treat Boxes. They will be also available September 4th when the new catalog goes live. So I hope you guys liked this kind of, I got kind of a mix of, um, of the new that's coming out. Um, oh my gosh, this is so cute. I'd love to, love to hear if you guys like what kind of Christmas stuff that you like. Um, I like the Dear Santa. Like I said, we had a couple of really cute, this one is really adorable too. The warms my heart. And I'm just excited about coloring too. I like the coloring. And like I said, I had to get that. I got to use that little one. I can't tell which I like better. I mean, they're all so super cute. These little kids are just totes adorbs. Um, very adorable. And then I love, 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 love that designer series paper. So pretty. It's gorgeous, gorgeous. Oh, they're so cute. They're super cute right um and then this one i can't wait to play with too because um with the whipped cream that just looks so fun um because you can put that on your pie too probably um there's marshmallows it's got a tiny pumpkin it's cool super cool and like i said it cuts all those out you get all the words i love all the word dyes you're looking for a donut right there that's a nice donut there and then of course all the designer chairs paper and there are of course in, in the cat, new catalog, there are a bunch of florals. There's like a beautiful winter floral. So there's reindeer. Um, there's so many. Uh, there's, there's a lot of awesomeness in this catalog. So I can't wait for you guys to see it. I do know I have another order started where I won't forget that shaded spruce. I cannot believe I thought I had it um, in my hands. And I, apparently I did not. But there, there's some beautiful... Um, this paper is just gorgeous, just so gorgeous. And there is two really great um, Christmas tree. There's one that has a bunch of very cool dyes that go with it, um, as well as some regular trees that I think are would be good for everything, but that are a little bit different than what we've seen before, or like the one that's on in the online store. Um, they always have. Oh, I almost showed you guys the inside. Don't, don't. I gotta put that aside so you can't see the inside, so I don't get in trouble. I'm going to get into trouble. Okay. But hopefully um, you will be getting one in your mailbox soon. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed this quick um, unboxing of all my um, fun new goodies you guys will be seeing me playing with. And um, I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Um, let's see. What else do we got going on? Oh, there's the designer series paper sale is going on now. Um, there is, you can save up to, I think it's 15% off of annual catalog um, designer shares paper. So that's something you can do right now. And then don't forget about your bonus coupons. Make sure you've used those bonus coupons you earned last month 
that in July that you can use now. Um, so that's super exciting. And then, of course, the um, coming up in September, we'll have the new paper pumpkin. And um, that's, that's going to have kind of a, a paper. Uh, it's going to be like a pumpkin. <laughs> um, it's got some really pretty whimsical ephemera. Right with a little snail, it's so cute. So you guys will keep keep an eye out. We'll be I'll be posting more about that stuff um, a little later. But I hope you guys enjoyed this quick unboxing of some of the fun new um, September to December 2024 mini catalog goodies. So anyway, I hope you have you guys have a great rest of your day. If you guys need anything um, in my online store, I'll have all of the links to my um, store below me. So if you need any of the Stampin' Up! products, I really appreciate um, your business and your support. Or if you guys are watching this later on on YouTube, make sure you guys like and subscribe to this video so you guys get, um, all get updated anytime I add a new video. Um, I hope you guys have a great rest of your day and happy crafting. Bye, guys.